What's going on guys? It's Pat Moore Poker and in today's episode, we're going to talk about the huge blunder made by Hanks on last night's 24 hour stream on Hustler Casino Live. Thank you guys for being here. Drop a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, ring the notifications bell and let's go. JR's got tens, Hanks has got nines. On. Hanks is all in. I don't think JR is going to fold. The last 45 minutes have been particularly ugly for Hanks. Like 130. All right. Yeah, JR's like, got me, you got me. I'm not folding Twice. tens, buddy. Two times. Pair? Yeah. You good? Twice. Molly's dead, buddy. Thanks. Pipped in this spot. Tens versus nines. Two hundred thirty-one thousand dollars in the pot. A rough, uh, a rough forty-five minutes for Hanks. How much he could do here? Oh, he's got a draw though. Looking for a club. Now he's got to fade a ten, and uh, the ten of spades is the only card. Or straight. Oh, wow. The club gets there and Hanks wins it. So JR picks up a straight draw. Oh, every hand max. He hits the straight, but it's the eight of clubs. So Hanks is going to win that one. They'll run it twice, though. And I would imagine, in all likelihood, chop it up. You gotta be pretty happy. You get tens versus nines, and nines, uh, nines chop it up. That's not bad. Nice shot. Oh no! Oh no, he didn't realize he's a fourth club out there. He hit the set on the turn, giving JR a straight draw. The straight got there, but Hanks did not realize they had a club in his hand. We don't get involved in these situations. And nobody saw his hand except us. He never turned it over. I guess five back. Everyone's on five. Oh my! So Jr. picks up a straight draw on the turn. And when it rains, it pours. That should have been a chop pot, but Hanks did not see the fourth club out there. Never turned his hand over. Not gonna lie, this was an extremely painful hand to watch, and you can't help but feel terrible for Hanks, who had a really brutal hour leading up to this pot, which almost certainly caused him to make this mistake. Let's take a quick look at the three huge pots Hanks played in the hour leading up to the nines versus tens hand. Jack. Jack would be bad for Santos. Jack, please. That is not a Jack, and Queen's full. <laughs> it's going to pay him off, though. $423,000 pot. And Hanks, you can see the frustration. Have a pair? Of course not. <laughs> of course, we don't have a pair. Yeah, let's see some cards. No pair versus no pair. Foster. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. He's got a deuce pair. Yeah. He's got a deuce. Two pair. I have a two pair. <laughs> deuce is good. Deuce good now? Deuce never loose. Five chops it up. Another deuce. <laughs> Charles, baby. Deuce on each run out. And Charles wins a two hundred eight thousand dollar pot. This is a fucking dream board. Tough break there for Hanks. <laughs> Hanks was extremely tilted going into this hand, and he had no idea he had a flush on the river on the first board. Or straight. Oh wow, the club gets there and Hanks wins it. This ended up being a really expensive mistake for Hanks, which cost him one hundred and sixteen thousand dollars. 
This hand serves as a really valuable lesson for poker players to make sure that no matter how tilted you get, to always make sure you remain focused and make sure you're reading the board clearly before you muck your cards. Let me know in the comments below if you think JR should give Hanks half the money back assuming they're friends, or if you think that's just poker and he should keep the money. Thank you guys for watching the video, and if you're looking to level up your poker skills, make sure you check out RaiseYourEdge.com. There's a link in the description below. They have both cash game and tournament courses, and I highly recommend both if you're trying to get better at poker quickly.